So in terms of drilling rigs, uh, we have witnessed a good growth uh, in 2016 and 2015, although in other countries, uh, drilling rigs were either stable or dropping, but in Kuwait, it was increasing. Uh, and, uh, you know, one of the things that could be a challenge for our clients is to have enough resources to manage these number of rigs when it comes into operations. So that's why Kuwait Oil Company has started the integrated project management model through a pilot that was awarded for us. And this entails drilling 40 wells under our full management and our full control mm -hmm. and handing them over to Kuwait Oil Company rather than them drilling them on their own. Mm -hmm. So today we have under this IPM project two rigs that uh, we are uh, supposed to drill 40 wells. And uh, so far, we have uh, delivered seven wells, and we are ahead of schedule in delivering these wells uh, for KOC. Okay. This is a pilot, and it is uh, going to be evaluated mm -hmm. and uh, to be decided by our client whether this is a model that they want to venture and go through. Mm -hmm. And I think it is something that the KOC management is convinced that this is the way to go to manage the number of wells, and in order to drill the wells that they plan to drill through this model. Right. Um, there is another project that is coming in the future um, that they are talking, the client is talking to us and to other service provider is to potentially uh, do the same model for the offshore. Uh, over the last couple of years, we have brought uh, new technologies uh, for fracking, where we have managed to increase the productivity of existing wells uh, through fracking uh, certain layers with uh, different technologies. The example is the broadband. And, um, you know, I can tell you that Kuwait Oil Company is a good adopter and a supportive and, uh, to, to bring new technologies, whether it is with the assets themselves or the research and technology uh, team within the KOC. Another uh, area is intelligent completions, where we have deployed recently in Kuwait, uh, which also helped to reduce the water cut in the wells and increase the efficiency and the production of these wells. Mm -hmm. Uh, and I don't have to tell you about the seismic, uh, which KOC and us are very proud of introducing the latest technologies. Mm -hmm. We have just completed the biggest uh, crew for Kuwait Oil Company. And uh, we are currently doing a small pilot mm -hmm. to uh, monitor the steam that is injected for the heavy oil mm -hmm. using subsurface uh, wireline tools and also surface seismic in an integrated approach to try and uh, visualize where the steam is invading for the heavy oil in order to manage the steam injection operations for the heavy oil team in KOC. So in Slumberjay, um, over the last couple of years, we have been working on what we refer to as the rig of the future. Uh, this is something that uh, we started uh, working on with a, an engineering firm and also with a uh, drilling uh, manufacturing a German company, Boyer. And um, I can tell you that this uh, rig of the future is going to be the uh, state-of-the-art uh, technology in drilling. Uh, we are going to uh, construct a fully automated rig from the mechanical side of it. But more importantly, we are going to integrate the subsurface um, information that is coming out while drilling mm -hmm. into the drilling mechanics uh, that can optimize the drilling uh, and that can increase the efficiency of um, uh, penetrating into hard formation or any other formations. Mm -hmm. Uh, not only that, it is going to be, uh, all of this is going to be integrated in a Slumberjay software, taking the subsurface existing knowledge, uh, plus the upcoming knowledge while drilling, feeding it back into the drilling uh, mechanics, improving the uh, efficiency of the rig. Uh, it will also reduce the number of people uh, on the rig, which will uh, decrease the HSE exposure uh, for us. and. Uh, we are hoping that uh, the prototype will be ready uh, and will be demonstrated for the industry this year. Mm -hmm. 
and uh, we are hoping then uh, that we will have the opportunities to bring it here in Kuwait. Okay. We have started talking to KOC about that, and uh, KOC and KPC actually, uh, CEO, are very excited about it, and um, we're just waiting for the opportunity that, to come to bring this uh, into Kuwait mm -hmm. to help uh, KOC in yet their existing challenge of managing the rigs and improving their efficiency on the rigs. Okay.